Hi, Jilly. Jilly! What are you doing up? It's almost midnight. I think I heard Santa. That's just Mr. Kelly across the street. He drinks a little too much, dresses up like Santa, and lets his horse pull around town for a couple of days. Are you sure? <sighs> Look out the window. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle all the way. Oh, my fun. It is a lot of fun. Oh, that's what. Can I sleep with you? Oh, Sarah, I thought you were over this. There's something under my bed. I heard it. This is the last night. I pinky swear it. There's nothing under your... Okay, fine. One more night. Huh? Do you think Santa will come? If he comes every year, Sarah, he'll come this year and I go to sleep so we can get here. There's something under my bed. Go away, Sarah. This is the last night. I pinky swear it. G6. What's wrong, Billy? I hate Christmas. Hope we never have another one. Shh. Santa might hear you, and then he might not come again next year. Yeah. Well, I got news for you, Sarah. There's no such thing as Santa Claus, okay? It's just some stupid lie parents make up to keep you acting good all year. You're wrong. I asked for a doll and I got one. Dolls are for babies. When are you just gonna grow up and get a life? I asked Santa Claus for a jump shot. I didn't get one. What does that tell you? Santa doesn't give jump shots. You have to practice. Be logical, Sarah. You really think that one guy can go to millions of houses and deliver thousands of presents in one single night? Come on, even you're not that stupid. You're lying. Santa's real on Christmas is the best day of the year. Yeah, well, think about what happened on this Christmas. Uncle David came, and he decided to bring a volume out to Greenwood Falls. Do you know what that means? That means that Dad's going to lose the store, and, and, and we'll have to move out, and nothing will ever be the same again. And then on top of that, i got to clean out the garage for the rest of Christmas vacation. None of that's ever going to happen. You love Christmas so much. You better wish it was Christmas every day. Because after tomorrow, everything changes. Our lives are ruined. Fine. I wish it was Christmas every day. Yeah, good luck. I wish it was Christmas every day. Just go to sleep, Sarah. Say you wish it was Christmas every day. No, it's stupid. Say you wish it was Christmas every day. Fine. And will you go to sleep? Yes. Fine. I wish you a Christmas every day. Is this some kind of elaborate punishment about last night? Because it's really freaking me out. What are you talking about? What did you do last Don't night? Don't you remember when you wished it was Christmas every day? No. What are you talking about, Billy? It works, Sarah. It's Christmas again. You better stop trying to scare me or I'm going to tell Mom and Dad. It's wrong, Billy. Say you wish that Christmas was over. It is over. Just say it or you got to get out of my room. Fine, I wish Christmas was over. Okay. Good. I will not sleep. Sleep is very bad. Sleep is bad, Billy. You won't sleep. I won't sleep. <sighs> Come out. You've been under there for hours. I don't care. I may never come out. I'm being forced to live the same day over and over again, and I'm not even good at it. I'm gonna have a black eye till the end of time. What's really wrong, Billy? I told you every single night for days and days, but you never remember. I completely and totally give up. You know, I just, I don't care anymore. 
Joey will always be able to beat me up, and Diane will never even care about me. Why go on? Remember when I was five and I didn't want to go to school because the kids were making fun of me? Because you couldn't read yet. You read me one fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish every night for a whole month. And you memorized it. <laughs> I pretended I could read it to the class, and then they stopped making fun of me. Yeah, I remember. You knew I would learn to read, and I did. You're my big brother. You're too smart to give up. Man, maybe she's right. It's Hi, Billy. Sarah, what would you do if you had to live the same Christmas over and over again? I don't know. I guess I get millions of presents, tons of chocolate, no bedtime. I guess I have the most perfect Christmas in the whole world. That's it. Sarah, you're a genius. Really? Yeah, that's the answer. What are you talking about? The most perfect Christmas in the world. <laughs> What's wrong, Billy? We're lucky to have mom and dad. I know. No. Some people don't even have anything, Sarah. Even on Christmas. I mean, mom and dad, man, they give us so much. Mom and dad help a lot of people, too. We should do something, too. What can we do? We're just kids. Can I sleep with you? There's nothing under your bed, Sarah. How do you know? Let's go and see. See? There's nothing to be afraid of. Look under my bed. There's nothing under your bed. Look and see. No way, it's too dark. Sarah, look under your bed. I'm scared. It's okay. Is this all for me? <laughs> yep. A little house and Christmas trees. This is so totally great. I'm glad you like it. I love it, Billy. Thanks. No sweat. I think I'll sleep in here tonight. <laughs> okay. Merry Christmas, Billy. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Sarah. is a Santa. I, I was wrong. He's real. I know. You're the one that didn't believe. <laughs>